This is clean cut. I don't know. Joseph and I looked at a house on the other side. I don't think I ever showed you this neighborhood, Bianca, but um, it's not as matured out. None of these homes are very old. So I do think you're going to like the interior. And I do think this one had a, um, a big yard. This house has more of a feel of the one that Bianca and I went into in Bainbridge and the one that Joseph and I went into um, that backed against McMillan. And, yeah, 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 McMillan or Eustick. I can't remember which street. Um, nice little office. No. The interior details nice. The crown mold. High door. Here. Nice little built-in. Closet. This closet's gonna go underneath the stairs. Oh, this is the exact floor plan that Christy and I went into in that house um, that had the big yard. That is condition crawl. Remember? It was the one over, oh, I can't think of the name of it, that Christy liked, where the yard was huge, um, but it was around the side. Wow. They thinned out. Nice three-car garage. You've got a little sink over here, so that's nice. Central back. None of this is going to be too old. It's probably got the install date. Of 20, I think. Oh, 17. I don't think this house could have been built in 2017. Better than the other one. The other one didn't have this great pantry. I'm going to have to snack one of these. Double oven. Gas range. I like the detail. Big, huge yard, but not as filled in as you wanted. Nobody would be behind you. Looks like two trees came out and I would put evergreens back there. So I would have privacy. That's the Walmart right there, Panda Express. This is, um, hmm, 10 mile? Not 10 mile. Um, oh yeah, maybe 10 mile. This might be 10 mile and going up there. Shoot, I think it is. I think the next one over is Black Cat. Nice big yard. covered. Kids over here. like that I something would eventually go over there but I don't know how much of your um I don't know I want it treat in but some I do kind of like the view I don't like the view of the panda or the walmart though but kind of like just being able to see the mountains and it's really cloudy today let me see what these look like oh they're nice never mind I thought they might be weird but they're kind of a grayish color and these are the kind that go top to bottom. So if you wanted them up a blaze, you could still have all the light coming in. 
Huh. This house is more your style for sure. In the corner again. I like the detail. It feels very clean and simple. Yep. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. Somebody forgot to take it out. There, a little linen closet here. I like the trim detail. I do think that pantry um, makes it so this kitchen can remain a lot cleaner. Boozy station. I don't know why people think they need furniture or landing. They don't. Don't need. Oh. Um. Actually. Yeah, I guess it is the same as that other house. So bedroom number one up here. Bedroom number two. It's pretty much like a new home. It feels, smells, looks like new construction. Bathroom. This is tile. The quartz. I like that it's got the door to separate it. A big bonus room. And then another bedroom. So this is one of those homes where two of the kids would be sharing the rooms until this one's very clean cut. I don't know how it's got a nice big yard. You would have to let landscaping fill in, which honestly, it doesn't take that long. I mean, we've been in our house four years and I should take a little video over the back and show you what the landscaping did. No, it's five years now, but... But even at year four, it was pretty much what it looks like now. Oh, that Trumper's over there. I'm always scared of people who will openly admit they voted for him. <laughs> Yeah, it's, I mean, I don't even think these people lived in this very much. I think all of this upstairs was just not used. <laughs> it literally feels, oh, God, look at how they did live in it. It feels like brand new construction. No complaints on this one. Well, one complaint. I, I would really like for it to have one more bedroom for you guys. But you'd be able to live comfortably in this for a long time. And you'd be able to make something out of that. I know it's exactly what you didn't want, Bianca's big blank slate. But I will say, the yard is huge. So, I would work with the big slate. See this and i'll see if this is really built in 2017 that doesn't seem like it makes sense but see what five years does see all their trees and i don't even know if they put them in at year one but all these trees on the outside would have been and i think these trees here will match those so i definitely would put some evergreens i would fill the whole back honestly full of trees trees and bushes just to 
give me privacy. Very clean cut, not one little project to do. Move in and call it good. This is 775 though. Oh, I came into this one because it's been on the market um, a while and I was gonna see if they would go for like a 750 offer price. I don't even know where that puts you at though. I don't know if that's comfortable or not at this point anymore. Did I miss this little room? I might have missed this little room. This isn't an area I would use. And this is the house on Terso, I believe it is. Ah, the whole world looks nicer with the landscaping filled in. Roller skating, roller plating, scooters, all of it's going to have to be on the sidewalk. <laughs> 